Hello, Year 3, 4. Now, yesterday we started looking at adverbs and adverbial phrases. Today, we're going to look at moving these within a sentence, specifically moving them to the start of a sentence to make a fronted adverbial. Now, that's the phrase that you should recognise by this point. So, again, I've got this sentence, the small white dog barked this morning. So this morning is the adverbial phrase. It's got two words, so it's an adverbial phrase. And it describes when this dog barked. If this is the adverbial phrase, I can move it in the sentence to somewhere else to change the structure of that sentence. So I can do this. This morning, comma, the small, comma, white dog barked. I've taken this adverbial phrase, I've shifted it to the start of the sentence, clearly it must have a capital letter for that, and you will notice that it has a comma after it, that's very important. An adverbial at the start of a sentence must be followed by a comma. So this morning, comma, the small white dog barked. OK, so this can be for when it happened. So the small white dog barked and I can have the small white dog barked at night. And then I can shift this to the start of the sentence at night, comma, small white dog barked. I could do the same with place. The small, comma, white dog barked in the garden. I can shift this to the start of the sentence in the garden, comma, the small, comma, white dog barked. I could do it for how, for manner as well. The small, comma, white dog barked loudly. Well, loudly, comma, the small, comma, white dog barked. Stop. OK. So for today's task, you have the same set of sentences as yesterday, but this time I've underlined the adverbs and the adverbial phrases in each sentence. What I'd like you to do is to move that adverb, your adverbial phrase, to the start of each sentence to make it into a fronted adverbial. Don't forget to follow with the comma. Okay, have a go.